Yo, what's going on guys? Phaser here and welcome back to a brand new video. Uh, you might be wondering what I'm doing in the end and how I got here. Well, if you didn't know, I did stream me beating the Ender Dragon. I did find two, I think, two end cities, but there was no end ship. So yeah, that's a big bummer. Um, yeah, so that's why I'm here at the beginning of the video. So basically what I'm going to do is that I'm going to keep on bridging out into the void and we go and look for more end cities and hopefully we'll find one fast. Oh my god, let's go. I am so happy. To be honest, that didn't take very that didn't take very long. Uh, that took a bit less time than I expected. I've been bridging for about 10 minutes, uh, plus the time it took for me to mine all the blocks. So I'm gonna get a lot more blocks and then bridge over there and get myself an elytra. Raiding the end city, just standard stuff. You know, getting hit by a thousand snot rockets. Uh, and yeah, after I do that, I'm just gonna head back to the base and start building the creeper farm and the sugar cane farm so that I have infinite rockets. And that reminds me, I have not explained why I am gonna be building that because, well, let me explain it to you guys now. You guys will be shocked to hear my explanation. It's because I, I'm about to get an elytra, you know? <laughs> I can finally fly around with rockets and not have to be a peasant and walk around on the ground no more so yeah that's why let's just approach this bad boy what bro what are you talking about man i can grab the elytra let's go boys all right there's nothing in this end city i'm pretty sure so let's just head out of here uh we're gonna find that gateway and then, well, we already got two shulker shells, so that's one shulker box. It's not that bad. Uh, we already have like another inventory of space, so that's quite nice. Uh, yeah, there's a gateway here we can use to return to the main island, and then we can get back to our base, and then we can finally start the creeper farm. I was so like you know excited to go to the outer end I just forgot to get this so let's just oh I thought it went through the portal I'm like bro <laughs> oh this is so laggy there we go um, I don't need the end stone let's go the next generation back into the portal minecraft credits mm -hmm. yep impressive let's just skip that and it's not loading hello there we go it's a bit slow <laughs> i i am not gonna lie all right so uh now that we're back from the end i did store up all my stuff i do have to get mending and i'm breaking on this the fps is dropping like crazy again uh so i do have a bed on me all right let's just go to the village go to my mending villager we actually we need to go to the pillager farm or raid farm and get some of that emeralds real quick. I might have to switch to my chest plate for now so that we don't use up all of the durability straight away. But yeah, we need to get some emeralds and then we'll uh, 
trade with the villager. Okay, yeah, that's enough emeralds. Uh, now we can go on ahead, head to our... Actually, before we do that, I need to uh, drink some milk. Oh god, I forgot. He needs some milk! Uh, we can just fly away, don't worry about it. They're gonna despawn. Alright, yeah, we need some milk. Actually, I don't need to. It already got rid of my bad omen effect for me, man. It's great. Alright, let's go to the mending librarian. Uh, where we need a, uh, book, so... Alright, what can we do to get some... Leather. Well, oh, well. Uh, let's say hi to this horsey here. Uh, I think he just despawned, guys. I mean, honestly, man, I had nothing to do with it. I think he just despawned. Uh, I, I had, honestly, I had nothing to do with it. Don't worry about it, guys. Uh, it's not me. It's not me. I think it might be the game. Uh, yeah, that horse just suddenly disappeared in front of our very eyes, huh? Uh, I guess someone's having a rough day today. <laughs> Alright, let's go buy that uh, mending book and then we can go and fix our elytra at the raid farm again. So, let's see. Mending. <laughs> yes, sir. Alright, thank you. Now, uh, I have to see if they have unbreaking or not. If they don't, I'm gonna have to trade for one. But obviously, I'm gonna have to do that off camera because this is getting really sidetracked here. So, um, yeah. Our main focus is getting a creeper farm and a sugar cane farm. So, yeah. Uh, they don't sell unbreaking, so I'm gonna have to do that later. But yeah, uh, let's go in and uh, enchant our elytra and then fix it up. Okay guys, so um, I'm done uh, repairing my elytra basically. I used it to get back to my home. Um, we can now officially start collecting materials for the farm. This is gonna take quite a long time because the farm is gonna be really big. So yeah, let's stop wasting time and get to collecting. Also, um, if you couldn't tell, this was uh, re-recorded because... Um, the video file got corrupted. So yeah, uh, I basically already got all the materials and finished the farm already. And this is during editing when I discovered that, so yeah. So I just had to re-record it. <laughs> this is kind of awkward because I already finished collecting all the materials and now I'm saying I have to collect it, which is really weird. Okay guys, so what I'm deciding to do is to build a very simple concrete converter. Uh, it converts concrete powder to concrete, obviously, um, and it's really compact. And it takes literally no blocks at all. Uh, you probably can't tell the difference from my inventory management, but I basically had everything already in my chest, so 
yeah that was pretty convenient so i'm just gonna build that real quick and get back to converting the concrete Let's just head on over to the ocean. Uh, yeah, and then we'll have to place down a temporary platform. We'll have to find a good place to build the farm. But this place looks pretty good enough to me, you know? This place in the middle of nowhere. Actually, it's just right by my home, but we're not gonna talk about that. Uh, I'm just gonna get my blocks here and then just gonna place it right there here we go so here's the plan uh let me fly off so what we're gonna do for this farm uh i'm gonna build like this huge firework rocket shit not not like an actual rocket like this thing over like this part of the ocean and i did not see this this could affect the rate of spawn so what I am going to do is going to light it up. So what I was saying, this is going to be this like huge firework rocket, and then um, you guys might be wondering, a firework rocket that's kind of small, ain't it? It's like this tiny. Well, uh, let me tell you. You see all of those pixels over there? Yeah, each one of them is going to probably be six by six. So it's not going to be that small. Uh, yeah anyways let me sleep uh what i need to do first thing is i want to see how big exactly is like the radius or the diameter of the uh thing of the firework rocket a bigger version uh, of a firework rocket is we'll just get to building a uh basically the base of the rocket So foggy, but I've never seen clearer I don't really think anyone can save me And honestly, I'm not really sure I want saving I like to be my own worst enemy There's no risk if you don't try at anything So I'ma just get by in everything See you in the next life, have to be a better me I don't think that my head's on straight Gotta flip it and grip it and go and get an x-ray What's wrong with me? I just feel way Pushing on my chest and it squeeze till I suffocate Better change my mindset, meditate It's pretty cool that I'm alive and have better days I could walk, see, here, I should celebrate Think I could change my mind, maybe elevate Living life, every day, late at night Not okay, all I want, and I pray All I need are some better days Yeah, all I need are some better days Cause all I want, and I pray I believe in the better yeah. days Kinda stuck between a rock and a hard place Do I work hard or live in my pace? You're only young once, yeah that's all great But I also want a future where I'm okay Living life is doing lots of cocaine Wait no, it's living with no shame Wait no, it's sleeping in on Sundays I guess it's different for each of us and that's okay 
Well, I just wanna be happy. How to get there? Hmm, glad that you asked me. I think it's different for everyone. Some of us need work, others need fun. Some of us need purpose to overcome. But try to do what you love when it's said and done. Cause there's so many differences in each of us. Trust your gut, it can show you what you want. Living life every day, late at night, not okay. All I want, and I pray, all I need are some better days. Yeah, all I need are some better days. Cause all I want, and I pray, I believe in the better days. Living life every day. Late at night, not okay, all I want, and I pray, all I need are some better days, yeah, all I need are some better days, cause all I want, and I pray, I believe in the better days. Okay guys, so I've basically finished uh, the killing system for the uh, creeper farm. Uh, you can see here I've built a pipe. So basically when a creeper drops the gunpowder, it will get shot into the ice, up this thing, and yeah, it basically works. Uh, I tested it, it's like a cannon. Uh, I mean, I even like stopped the thing over there, but like... Uh, it just shot straight out like I put three of these kelp in it and it just shot <laughs> into the middle of it there nearly landing on my cat so yeah it, it, it's like a cannon let me just tell you that uh, but yeah um, I'm gonna like stop the water flow right there for now because I do need to uh, work out where the collection room or the storage room will be you know, it's gonna be like the stomach, I guess, of the farm. This is the heart. Like the sugar cane farm I'm about to build up there is also the heart. I have not like explained my farm at all. I just realized. So yeah, you know how there's like the tip in the rocket, this part, like this triangular section. Uh, yeah, that inside that it's gonna be the uh, sugar cane farm, and I'll also try to fit the storage system in there as well. Uh, so yeah, um. Hopefully it turns out pretty good. Uh, I think the storage system is gonna be at the very top. I'm not sure. It could be at the very bottom as well. But yeah, we're gonna build a sugarcane farm somewhere over here. So yeah, uh, but before we do that, I just wanna build the exterior of this thing, like the rocket, all the way up uh, to basically this height because that is the high it's meant to be at, so yeah. And also my Minecraft laggy, my recording's not laggy, it's just my Minecraft. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. I might have to restart my computer again. So yeah, let's just get to building.
Okay guys, so as you guys can see, I am officially done with the bottom part of the rocket and with the creeper farm as well. Uh, now what I need to do is to basically, oh you can't see my cursor, that is a problem. But basically uh, on top of the firework, uh, there's gonna be a, uh, a sugar cane farm and yeah, basically I'm just gonna go and collect the materials needed for that and I can show you guys the collection system um, it's gonna look like this for now um, it's basically a water elevator that's gonna push all the gunpowder up and it'll uh, fall into like this chest with hoppers on top of it and yeah basically that's what I'm hoping for uh, that's the, gonna be the same that's gonna be the same for the uh, um, the sugar cane farm as well. What I'm gonna like the design I'm gonna use for the sugar cane farm is pretty like traditional. It's the uh, the pistons with observers on top. Obviously, it's not the fastest in my opinion. I mean, I'm sure there are faster ones, but like you know. Um, it, it, it's like the compact version and I can fit more of them and it'll be more efficient I believe in this design uh, than like huge sugar cane like fields with flying machines and stuff so yeah uh, that basically yeah that's the design I'm going for so um, what I'm gonna do first I'm just gonna make like a wireframe of the like the actual cone shaped thing on top of the firework uh, to see how much space I've got to work with and then I'll build all of the farms and the chest room should be right here in the middle so yeah let's just get right to it okay so first of all I need to collect a bunch of materials for this farm um, it's gonna take quite a long time. I, I need a lot of observers, hoppers, um, no, actually not hoppers, uh, rails, minecarts, uh, all of that stuff. Okay, so, um, I've just finished collecting all of the materials. It took quite a long time, but now I believe we are completely ready to start building the wireframe of the cone and, uh, also the farms as well. So yeah, let's just start building that.
Alright guys, I have officially uh, finished building the wireframe for it. We are completely ready to build the farm right now. Um, you can probably tell by the fact from the replay mod and from like right now that I built in the floor. I didn't build in the outside or fill in the outside yet. Uh, that's because I don't have enough red concrete, I think. So I, I definitely need to get more uh, of that. But yeah, but although I need to do like a quick update for you guys, um, obviously there's not gonna be enough time for me. Well, there could be if I didn't have like a schedule to follow so um this video like there's already been a month since the last video upload so that is a problem and i'm gonna have to meet that uh so i'm gonna have to try and post this video as soon as possible so that leads me to my point which is um i'm gonna like fill in like most or at least half hopefully of the um the top part with sugarcane farms but it's gonna meet the demand so it's not that bad i'm gonna fill the rest of them in probably off camera or something because right now my main focus is just to get video out for you guys so yeah i'm just gonna start building the farm right now and then after that we'll have to build a storage room for the um all the stuff which i plan on building it in the very center and then I'm going to have like a staircase or whatnot and then a piston door that goes in. So there will be multiple entrances, one water elevator that's going to go directly into the storage room and one staircase that's going to lead into the storage room when you open the piston door. Yeah, and there's going to be a lot of doors <laughs> and entrances. So yeah, without further ado, um, let's just start building. Now before we start um, building all of the sugar cane farms, uh, I'm just gonna fill in this top part in. You know, it will be easier to see how much room we have. I keep on saying that, but that is facts. I do need to see how much room we have. I'll be able to see how much space we can work with and I'll decide how many farms we can build and yeah. So let me just do that real quick. Sometimes it is faster, sometimes we are free. Oh, you take the long way to stay close to me. I don't want another, I just want to breathe. You take me higher, you stay close to me. I feel so alive, I feel so alive. The dark won't close my eyes. I feel so alive, I feel so alive. Oh, we chase the night. I feel so alive.
right guys we are completely finished with the uh, the exterior uh, apart from the like the bottom part of the rocket uh, the whole thing is basically done now we just need to fit in all the farms which I'm estimating I'll be able to fit like three or four because truth be told there's like close to no space in here I, I took up most of the space with this giant storage system um yeah so hopefully i'll be able to fit like one or two up there uh one here and another there or not here maybe here like one two three four like that hopefully that will work and then i'll just link up the storage system with the farm and then it'll all be done and then i can finally edit the video finish it and then get it out to you guys it's been so long it has taken me a little more than one and a half weeks uh, with like five hours of grinding each day so yeah it, it took quite a long time um you know it like I, the amount of gravel and sand and stone i've mined up it's insane let's just get to building all of the farms Alright guys, on that note, I want to thank you all so much for watching today's video. I've definitely got a lot of things on my to-do list for this farm. Uh, but yeah, uh, this farm seriously took me a long time to do and I'm still not finished. I just bumped my minecart. Yeah, this farm seriously took me a long time to do. It took like 6 hours of grinding each day and it took almost like 2 weeks plus to do. So it would be really appreciated if you guys could hit that subscribe button and like button as it helps me out a ton. It's free. You guys can always change your mind about it. You know, you can always take back the sub and like if you want. But yeah, it helps me out a ton. And I want to thank you all so much for watching today's video. And I'll see you guys in the next one.